Okay, so in this video clip, I'm going to run C++ code to implement a Monte Carlo simulation uh, of um, estimating call and put option. Um, the Monte Carlo is set up uh, using uh, Box Muller, and I've left an explanation of Box Muller here um, that's set up in, C in Excel. So that's one uh, you might click through, take a look at if uh, Box Muller is new. Um, so basically, uh, we'll run the code. Uh, we have the, the Black-Scholes model, model here, um, and we have then um, a simulation and the number of uh, pathways, number of simulations here is uh, 10 million. So uh, IE7 uh, is 10 million uh, pathways. So if we execute our code and then just run, we can take a look at how fast the execution time takes. It's, it's actually quite fast. Um, okay, so with 10 million, we have seven zeros here. With 10 million pathways, we have a value of 1044 using Monte Carlo for the call and 557 for the put. And we can see that compares actually quite closely with the Black Scholes model of 1045 for the call and 557. So these values are true. And with Monte Carlo simulation, you can see we're getting quite close. Now we can change our value here to 6 million, 1 million steps. So IE6 is 1 million, not steps, uh, simulations. And execute again, should be quite fast. It pops out quickly. A uh, little bit more error here in this instance. Uh, we could try um, going down to 100,000 and running again. So one and five zeros is 100,000 steps. Let's execute. And you can see a little bit of errors opening up. And we can go again uh, down to 10,000 steps, 10,000 pathways, and run our simulation here using Box Muller, 10,000. And you can see from the simulation 1036, 554, and that's a little bit out from the true value of 1045 for the call, 557. Um, okay, so let's go with um, one more little test here. Uh, we put that back to seven and we change our value here to five. And let's run and then try again here. Okay, now it's taking uh, a bit longer, so I might pause and note the time. It's now 11.02, no, it's outputted. And we have here five and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven zeros. Uh, the value from simulation is 1044, 557. So uh, reasonably close uh, uh, with the uh, simulation, of course, it's always random. So you're never going to get uh, exactly equal to true, but you tend to uh, converge to true as you increase the number of pathways. Okay, that's, uh, I leave the link to the code uh, below the video, you find the hyperlink and to the collab.